I've been waiting for this moment for most of my life. I guess what I'm trying to say is, I love you, Sam. But I went on without a listen. Will you marry me? But not for the reason you might be thinking of. I always wondered if I was truly in control of my life. I heard that you could see the face of the man you marry by doing some urban legend voodoo, and I naively pursued the matter. <laughs> so I panicked. Who wouldn't? But then it started, like a curse, really. The doubts. Hesitation and insecurity. Take my relationship with Andrew. I never want to see you again. What did you expect? If you love someone, you should show it. He's right. Just get out. Then there was Jack. You're gonna accept, aren't you? Look, I don't really have a choice. Jack, you said you work in LA. Even when I thought I was in control but, of my life. But things just don't work out that way. Is this gonna make you happy? Life threw me for a loop. I'm gonna take this off. You're not answering my question. I'm sorry, Sam. People say things happen for a reason. For me to turn around just in time. For me to drop my phone. I figure fate must have planned this all out. Is this yours? I asked Dan. About his scar. Fuck. Dude, mom's gonna be so pissed. I didn't do anything. It just exploded. Oh shit. So, where is the fine line between fate and freedom? Now I know. 